guys it's candace welcome back i know i know i'm sorry <sighs> you know you think you have a couple extra videos but then you don't and then the weather changes and you get this crazy major sinus migraine that you can't see you know those commercials where they have the claritin and claritin clear where they show you all the vision you know blurry stuff and then with claritin how clear it is well claritin doesn't work on me but that's how it is and then you know you just have that headache and you can't function so we're going to make this. I know you've seen these before, but well, we're going to do we're going to do it again, and we're going to use um, the Junk Journal Studio, the collage and cluster, some papers from that because they work perfect on envelopes. Some little um, Velcro dots. We put those there because I've already lost them once, and then two envelopes, and these are I guess legal size ones. They, and then the, I have, they're the same size, blah, 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 blah. So it's about nine and three eighths by your typical four and an eighth, as you can tell, bills. And so, you know, I did coffee dye them. So now I want to fold them over. This one is about, let's see what it ended up being. Cause I just did it to where it, it looked right. Three inches. So we're folding the this one at three inches, and you're gonna um, leave the writing on the top because we're gonna cover it. <coughs> and then the bottom one, I folded up. Looks like four and a quarter. Um, where's my? Sh 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 Hold on. I'm hoping that's the right size now that I've creased it and not paid attention. All right. Cause the main thing is, is you want your, you're going to take this one that you folded this way and we're going to put it on the bottom and you just need to make sure that your flap covers enough. So when you put your little Velcro on there, it opens and it sticks to here and it opens there. Now you are going to have to go do some repair work. I know that we always got to do some repair work. <sighs> You know, the, the little um, construction people, you, you just don't get what you, you know, you used to anymore. You always got to go in there and repair their little, their little sheetrock and all that other stuff. So let's just go ahead. It makes me feel better. I mean, you might not actually have to do this and this works great. You don't even have to coffee dye them. It's just, that's what I, I had some laying around and I'm like, well, <clears throat> let's play with some coffee dye. And let's lose our little, our little smusher. I mean, hello. It's got a burgundy top. There you go. Which, actually, I need the big one. <laughs> well, you know, you just got to flatten out the, your coffee dye a little better. And then you just want to make sure that your stuff is, you know, semi-neat. And then, you, you know, you want to cut. That's why I have this one. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, this thing hurts. It's, it, it, it's heavy. And you just want to make sure it's straight and then go ahead and put your, um, yeah, see that's, I was just a little hair off. I mean, you know, when you cut them open sometimes and then the same thing here, just make sure that we repair all of our little parts. You know, I got the doors open. It's nice. Everybody's down here now doors wide open upstairs I mean my gosh you literally have to be in the same room with them it's amazing they're stinking dogs why can't they just enjoy it I guess there's no horses there for them to be barking and hooping and hollering at so all right now let me look at my okay no it is all right so I'm putting the writing towards the inside because I'm leaving the back. Oh, this is, I'm bad. Hold on, I'm going to, I'm confused. Now I'm going to confuse you. We want this one, the writing on the back. Oh my God, Candace. Sorry, y'all. Because just in case you don't put it on as a pocket glue it on then you you can you know put it in and out and 
you have writing space back here. So that's when you you know just want to make sure that you do have all your stuff down because you know unless you want to go put some more coffee dye on top of it. But you know, hello. All right. So now this one that was three inches that we folded over, we folded over with the writing on the inside. And the, the plain backing back, so there's, you know, you can use it for journaling. And like I said, this one is the three inch flip that we did. Okay, good gosh. Now this one, where do you go? I'm just seeing how, okay, it is the inside. All right. And then this one, we have the inside on there because we're going to be using them as pockets. And we didn't, I didn't want any, like, this to get in the way of, you know, putting things in there. So, yeah. So let me go ahead and crease that the other direction. If you hear snoring, they're all around me. Okay. All right. So now let me just go ahead because I'm an inker. Yeah, I did finally find the top, but now I got to find my extra. Because these are the, from the potatoes. Sometimes, well, the older potato sacks. You got the large one on there. Because I just got another potato sack and it was a shorty. But I got tired of fighting with that bad boy. Oh. So since I'm an inker, I'm just going to go ahead and go around all of these things. Just, you know, to be safe. Well just in case whenever I cut, you know, it doesn't cover it. It'll be covered. I know, and then you're covering up all this beautiful coffee dye, but oh well. Say la vie. They will be more. We will make more. And then let me just go ahead and do back here in case this is going to be a, a tuck and not a journal or whatever. A pocket. Okay, now, um, on mine, I... You know, you could make this an extra, like, snip the side and do a secret tuck. But I just wanted mine to be a lid. So I just kind of, I just went here, not quite a half of an inch up, just to give it some stability. Because, you know, we're going to be ripping it up and down with the, um, the Velcro. All right. So, now... And then, like I said, when you put these together, the three-inch flipper is going to be on top. The ones that we folded, four and a quarter. Yes, four and a quarter. Just make sure it didn't change. We're going to put this down here. And then that's our one, two, three, four pocket. So we need to go, trim right here because this is definitely going to be a, a little pocket. Just a hair. And then I just need to go back and, you know, put a little extra ink on there. All right. So now. All right. So these are the strips from the kit. And these are like the perfect size. I mean, this will cover up here. And then we do have to trim a little bit down, but, you know. Oh, I guess I'm going to go that way. I like that. So we're going to, this is going to be our top one. And then, you know, this was some scrap. This was another one because it went with the, the yellows. And then I picked the green, this, um, what you dinky. I don't even know. <coughs> Rust color. And then this other one, because I thought it tied all these colors in pretty. All right. Let me see what I did. I know. It's been a couple days since I messed with this. All right, so we're here and here. Okay. So we'll put this aside for, for now. I guess over there. You know I'm going to lose it, but anyway. So then I'm going to take this one, and we're going to put it on here. I know... It's going to be a little empty space there, but that's what, you know, some of these other little things are for. Or 
I don't know which way do I like it. I did like it this way best. Okay, I know. Good grief. <laughs> oh. Yeah, Molly can get it. Let me tell you when she's snoring. Oh my gosh, now I've lost my pencil marks. Okay, right here. And right there. And if it's not right, well, we'll, we'll do them again. And I'm trying to... Okay, I think I want it maybe like that. Because this is what's going to be on top. Hmm. I know. I got to change my mind. Okay, I think I'm going to glue it on like that. All right. So... I mean, you know, just do a little mini collage. It, it shouldn't require that much thinking, but hey, it's Candace. What can I say? I'm going to stick him on. Oh my gosh. So Dawn did the, the, um, Barely Art Glue and the Art Glitter Glue test on Vellum. Yep. Barely Art Glitter Glue worked the best. So, I ordered a bottle. Because, you know, I had some uh, cash back on our credit card on there. So, I'm like, well... I guess we're going to try a bottle of this stuff because I really want to see it and really want to do. I mean, hello, I got 17 other kinds of glue. Why not another one? I mean, is it really going to hurt me? <laughs> oh, I know as long as the glue doesn't get expired. I know, and then you have more scrap. So then I'm going to put this one down here just to pull the the oranges and stuff from up here. So I'm gonna cut it here. There. Hmm. Let me just do it this way because I might need I might I might need some of this on something else. So I'll keep the long one. And then where did it go? I don't know. Right there. Whew, I got long sleeves on. It's not quite a long sleeve day. It's like, I don't know, 72, 74 maybe. And then tomorrow's going to be stinking 77. I mean, hello. <laughs> we won't be having the, wind, the doors open tomorrow. Like I said, I wish I had one of those clapper things down here to um get the doors to close just so we don't you know invite any friends in here any any stink bugs since it is warm they will be coming they will be coming back alive because they you know they just turn over on their bellies these big ass bugs and look like they're dead but then you go to sweep them and they start moving again i mean they're the weirdest things i'm telling you they're related to damn cockroaches an atom bomb couldn't kill them I wish they'd just go back where they came from. Leave me alone. I hate them. Oh. But yeah. I mean, you're like, oh, there's like thousands out there every morning. And you're like, oh, well, let me just go sweep them. They're dead because it was a cool night. No, they're not dead. They're just in weird stink bug hibernation or something. I don't know. Okay, so we have that. Now, let me see. Do, 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 do. I know, it's been too long since I pulled these. Was I putting that there? And then maybe this behind here? Or does it look, yeah, I think so. Okay, so I just need to cut a little bit off here.
And I'm telling you, I don't know what's going on, but Lord, I mean, I have absolutely no energy. I don't sleep, even though I kind of am sleeping, but I'm not really sleeping. If that, if you know, I wake up all night, and I know, and I'm just, I don't know. I know what's driving me a little bit bonkers, because you just don't have any oomph oomph during the day. Oops. Yeah, getting ready on again. <clears throat> Sorry. All right. And truly, well, you know, plus with my headache and stuff the last two days, I just haven't done anything because I didn't have nothing in the, in the tank to do. And then you take those pills and they just make you, you know, they make you tired. So I think I watched some movies. I don't know because I don't really remember. I had my tie tied on my head. Yup. And that's how she went. Oh, sorry. I know that's so rude, isn't it? Oh, come on, get underneath there. All right, so we just need to. I'm cutting about one and a quarter. It probably doesn't even need to be that long. It's just strengthening this this back part up for, you know, to be able to be tucked in the back. Yeah. Welcome to the snore fest. <laughs> I mean, little girls behind me just passed out softly sawing her little logs. Molly's down there. Just got her little rhythm going. And I'm telling you, and if you listen to it too too closely, it will make you sleepy. It's it's amazing. But now it doesn't work when you're trying to go to bed at night and everybody's in there doing their snore fest. No. Lord keeps you up. All right, so I got that in there just to reinforce. Our soon-to-be pocket. Oh, gosh. All right, and then, let me see. I'm going to do a little thumb notch on that one. As I wear my thing. And so that way it shows your little pocket. Is that not straight or something? Just look. Where's my scissors? Yoo-hoo. Buried. That's where they are. Yep. I mean, just why? Why must I see that? Oh, no. But I did. Okay. And then we need to put another one in here, which I'm going to use. Ooh. Oh, sorry, my back itched. <laughs> Which I'm going to use this. I know if I had the sense, flip it around, mark it on the back so you can see where the heck you're cutting it. But no, again, I still have no sense. But I did, like yesterday, try to come down here for a little while and um, got all my, all the little scraps that was over here, you know, kind of together because I'm going to. I'm going to make something with all of them because I'm not throwing them away. I'm not putting them up. I have plenty of other stuff to put up. So I'm going to, I made some book page pockets, some easy ones, and I'm going to throw some, we're going to do a leftover goulash. I know. So let me go ahead and put a little holy in here. We're going to make them holy. Okay, put that up. 
and then our little rust will shine through shine through baby shine through oh Whew. I know I hate not being able to see well up close I, I need to go take another one of those pills but then it made me sleepy and I, I gotta get something done Gotta get a video done. <laughs> oh, upside down, Candace. That's why you inked it. So you could see. All right. And now Diana Ross is upside down. Boy, you turn me inside out. Round and round. I know. So my sister-in-law, <laughs> they managed to pick up a stray. Well, her godchild picked it up, and they couldn't keep it. So, And it's a big old yellow lab, and uh, John's brother, Conrad. And so um, she, I had called her back yesterday, and she's like, you won't believe what we got. And I'm like, oh, my gosh. You know, I figured they got their pool put in or something. She, uh, and I'm like, what? She says, we got a dog. I'm like, no way. And she's like, yeah. And they were talking about getting a shih tzu. You know, a smaller dog. Because they travel a lot when Conrad's home. And he's going to retire in a couple of years. Well, now they've got this beast. And uh, so, yeah, no. They didn't get anything little. They had to get, you know, a monster. But she's really sweet really sweet. <coughs> Cheryl's really taken to her, which is, you know, awesome. You know, Conrad did the, you know, oh, mama, please, I'll do this. I'll do that. I know that, that they'll be expensive in the beginning and da, da, da. And she's like, I couldn't tell him no. <laughs> so they <coughs> now have a dog. Oh, my gosh. And like I said, not any dog. They got a, a big dog. I'm just looking for some scrap to put on here so we can make... This can be a writing space, but I really wanted... Well, look, this, our other paper will thicken it up. i got to put all this... Hold on, let me put that back in. Let's scrap it in. Okay. So this will be fine because we are going to um, put stuff on the front. Okay, so this looks like it's going to be the best fit. Oh, so yeah, and then her son. <laughs> I mean, Brian's like 34. His, her youngest is the same age as, as my youngest, our youngest. And um, they just he just lost his other pity to um old age his last one she passed away she had ca got cancer and was you know yeah it was sad so anyway so he's over there telling her you know this that and other and oh well, you need to give her a treat every time she's like no in this house we don't give the dog a treat every time we go out into the garage and back or because I mean he did he spoiled his little babies and uh it was it's funny and he's like I understand it's your house it's your rules <laughs> it's your dog she's like yep but it's funny I cannot believe she got the a beast. And then, you know, she's, you know, labs are just goofy no matter how old they are. They think it's about two years old. She brought it to the vet yesterday because, you know, they posted it on social media and all kinds of stuff because her um, godchild had found it. It was running across a, a main highway and about to get hit and cause an accident and all kinds of stuff. So she stopped and, and got it and 
it is thin. I mean, it weighs 69 pounds right now, and it, it needs a good 10 pounds put on it because it's, yeah, it's it's missed some food. It's a you know a little definitely ribby, but she's got she really does have a good dis disposition and stuff. But I know now I'm kind of wondering. I think I do. I want to put ooh. Um, I want to mix my glues together, but I think I want to put another color on top, just because I'm going to have that, um, what you dinky, that Velcro on there. I'm afraid that this might be too thin, so that's too short. Well, stink bugs, I know. I just, we just happen to have some. This is thicker stuff. So, well, I know we're going to use it after all. And then my glue is going to dry. Oh! I'll have to re-wet it. But, yep, that's, that's what I want. But anyway, they, you know, put the dog, brought it to the vet. It wasn't microchipped. They... Um, put it on social media for um, a week and nobody claimed it. I mean, they even said, you know, she did all that stuff, you know, where it was found. And she said that it had a collar, but it looked like somebody cut the tags or whatever. I really think that dog was dumped because, of course, the dog is in heat. And um, I really think someone dumped her. I said, Are you sure she's not pregnant? She says, No, they said she's not. And, um, but anyway. But she is, she's something. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> yep. They're going to have their hands full. And she's like, and we were going to the casino. And I'm like, well, who's going to watch the dog? <laughs> I'm like, that's why, you know, me and John, you know, well, minus the cancer. But. And we didn't have as many dogs, but that's why we, you know, couldn't hardly go anywhere because we had all these animals. And we don't know anybody to watch them. So, and it's not like they're just outside. You can come by, check on them, throw them some food and water. You know, they're, they're spoiled, rotten, indoor babies. But let me tell you what, hers is going to be way, way more spoiled than ours. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that's okay. Everybody deserves to be spoiled and loved, huh? Okay, so now that I've done all that, oh, now, because that's our pocket back there, and then you can still, you know, write down here. <clears throat> I know I'm wondering, do I want to? And you know the answer is yes. Oh, just because that's in my way. See, we're never going to get a project done because I keep changing my mind. But. Rip that off. Throw it on my shoulder for good luck. And. Tear that. All right, we got a third dog. I wish y'all could hear, you know, really hear them because. Oh, I'm telling you. It does crack me up at times. Like I said, sometime tonight, I got to leave the room and go to the other, the other room so I can get some peace and quiet. Because <laughs> when they all get at it, there's just too much snoring coming from, from, you know, three different directions around the bed. And it's like, and if you're not asleep, you can forget it. Oops. And I'm gluing it on here. And now I'm, I'm going to. <laughs> have a hot mess. All right, I just feel better with this on here. Just because that's, I don't know, lightly, whatever. Okay, so, and now, like I said, I got glue in here. Got to get the, the glueness off. <laughs> oh, my gosh. 
Okay, that feels un unglued now. All right, I feel much better. All right, so now we're going to just glue this and this because we're going to make our first set of pockets. <laughs> Not like they didn't just wake up from a nap a little while ago, too. <sighs> so anyway... have that and that gives us our first two pockets just got to give it a hot minute to do and then now we're going to come and glue this one on here to make our our next set of pockets and see this that whatever you slide back there we're going to have a problem so let's go ahead and <clears throat> Excuse me, glue that down flatter. All right, now we're going to make our big U, our big C, whatever you want to call it. And then we'll put this on here. And that gives us our our other two pockets. I know. So now we've got a, a one pocket, two pocket, three pocket, four. And like I said, if you want to snip a side on there, you can make a little secret there. But I'm not. I got enough. <laughs> four is enough. <laughs> All right. Let's just, let's just hit it back here one time. Hit me, baby, one more time. I know, I can't believe I was there with that one. Anyway. Whoops, timber. Ooh. I sure missed some spots right here when I was inking. Well, what the heck? I don't know what got over me. <laughs> All right, so now we're going to use our front... And we are going to, oh Lord, I don't know. did I put it up? I sure don't remember. Mm, yes, I did. Okay. I know that's just second nature there, putting that pin up. And that comes from working and engraving that, because I'd always lose it. <laughs> Imagine that. But I was much neater and more, you know, anal when it came to all that over there. All right. I had my stuff together here. Well, that's because every everything had a place over there, and that's my problem here. Nobody's got a place. It's just the boma, like a big old eagle's nest. <laughs> I sit in the middle, and all the other stuff is around me. Oh, and you know, let me tell you. And that's what makes it hard to craft because you can't find nothing. And you can't put nothing up because nothing has a, a for real spot, if that makes any sense. All right. Let's glue this bad boy on here. Then get our dots on. I, I gotta go down and check the mail. I hadn't done it in three days. Like I said, I hadn't done that in three days. Wash machine still pulled out. Because, you know, you gotta have some brain thought on that. And oh, you just can't have brain thought when you got a sinus pressure. Alright, so we got that one on there. 
got a little dizzy. I know, see? <laughs> that is the problem with those things, because yeah, you get the wonky wonks. If you move your head too fast, you know, you get that, whoa. John used to call it free high. I'm like, oh, whatever. Free high or your butt on the ground. Moving too fast. So there. There's that. I know we're going to have to decorate it. So let's get our dots. No, we're not getting our ice cream dots. We're getting our Velcro dots. Now, did I... Oop, still don't have those fingernails, so, you know, it's hard to get underneath anything. There we go. And I think these, these bad boys would stick, but I am putting some glue on them. Okay, so. Ooh, nope, gotta move it up. Okay. Ow! Man. I know I forget that size like a cactus. And then put that side on there. Put a little glue and smush it down. And then, you know, you gotta wait a while. But we still gotta do a little decoration on the front, so that'll give us some time. Oh man, that hurt my finger. Okay. So we got that. Let me put these over here before I lose them. Oh, and you too. I know. I, I just got tons more scraps. So where's my labels for this? I know. I found this the other day when I was cleaning some stuff. I know it's dirty, but it's old. And I was like, oh, you know, those people always put their little thingies in here. So I put a few thingies in there. All right, so we need something long. That away. Did I pull the? Are these them? No, this is for something else. You know, I got stuff paper clipped together, so you just never know. Okay, so who's gonna go? We got that one. No. Yeah, I think we have to stick with him. So we have him. And then we have our other little labels back here. Oh, you know, this would fit in here. Oh, sure would. All right, so then I have that. We have a number eight somewhere. Do-do-do-do-do-do. use this on here and one of these if I can get them oh, there we go I know they kind of stick together and now I'm gonna wonder oh what did I do with my thingy it's right in there but I won't remember anyway <laughs> cuckoo too much information that this is a sticker these are not so and this says no smoke without fire but we're going to cover it up so you know it's not going to be that bad and then of course we're going to get out some dimensional dots and dot her up well There we go. And these are sticky too. But I don't trust to stick them. You know, I gotta I got to put some more some of my own on there. So put that little bird on here. And then whoops. If my paper doesn't fly away. Oh, 
So right there looks fine. Fine and dandy. <laughs> Can't wait till my fingernails grow back. <laughs> I don't know how people do it. You know, you watch people who have no nails and it's just like, how they pick things up. You know, I'm guessing you're used to it. And then you see all those people that have, you know, all those, those long fake nails. And I mean, I can't pick anything up with a fake nail. <laughs> but I guess you just get used to what you got. Okay. So. Dum, 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 dum. Well. Ah, there we go. So like I said, here's my first one that we did, that I did. And like I said, right, right, right. And it, it can go into a pocket because it's only um, four and a quarter. So if you got a, a you know back pocket, side tuck or whatever, journal space back here. And, you know, if you want to slip the side, you can make a little, another little thing. But psh, like I said, we got four pockets. So we got the back one here. We got this one there. We got that one here, and we got this one there, here, there, over there, everywhere, there, there. I know, I, but I, I had to use that sunflower because I loved it. And oh, yep, ow, jeez, wheeze. Maybe I need to start doing them backwards. Let me just make sure that everybody's safe in here and you can get in. <laughs> and the answer is yes, you can. And. That's one. So, oh, yep. So now we need to put some. Let me get my little dots over here because I like those colors. Which is the sage. Oh, olive. I'm bad, bad. Olive. And I believe this is terracotta. Yes. So, I mean, this could almost have another label. I know. Let's see. What do we have? What do we have? What do we have? Oops, I know my trash bag is full. That's what I got. That's what I have, what I have. Oh, all my little scraps I've been chopping. Um, let's see. Is that too much green? Maybe. Put the black one. Or... Hmm, I think I like that one. I know. Okay, now we got to ink a little, ink a bit first, though. Do do. -do. All right. Let's put him on here. Just because it needed something. He was a little naked there. All right. So now we're going to put our dots on. Tap these and see what we got. Woo! Almost a mess. I know. Put... I know. I might want to put a navy on there. I, I know. Hello. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. So I know I think I might put some navy on there. Hold on. Let me roll back here and get some navy. Oh. I think we just need some because of... bird or something. I don't know. 
All right, let's tap them down and see what we got. Well, this isn't a navy. It's marine. <laughs> marine. No, marine. Like, you know, nautical marine. Did I get them all? All right. So, there we go. We have those two that we did. Well, I did this, and this is my prototype. And this is the one that we, you know, took forever to do. But you can do a whole lot with them. Um, I have this other one that I was going to do, that you know, to do the same thing with. Same plan. But I wanted to put it on differently because this envelope is a little bit smaller. I know I need to glue it down and all that good stuff because it just slap came open. I don't know, maybe this isn't even a good one to use since it's not even attached anymore. <laughs> but I wanted to use a, a skinnier one and attach it to the side. And then, um, you know, we'd still cut right here, but glue here and on the side. And then this would be a side tuck if, if you understand, if you follow along with that one. But obviously I need a different envelope because, well, he's, oh my God, cremation information. Jeez Louise, I'm telling you. It's amazing who gets you on what list. All right, so, but I will probably make that one and then, and show you, but it's the same concept as the other one, just that, you know, it was a little shorter, so I thought that would be a cute little side tuck. So maybe we'll just do that one in a hot minute. All right, well, I hope y'all enjoyed it. I hope you had fun. And I'm, I'm really sitting here thinking, you know I'm thinking really hard. It needs some splatter. I know it does. Ooh, that was close, Candace. Um, let's see, let's put some... Micah, well, you got to shake it. I know, I got a few minutes to burn. Let's see. Oh, I did have washi tape on that one. Maybe I need to put some washi on here too, but I don't know. Let's see if we can do... All right, that, who else is calling me? I don't know, now I see this, I want to put it on there. I know, it's bad. It's really hard. It's so addictive. Oh, we got this blue. Maybe, should we put, that's too light, but it is like that one. But we do have this other blue. Hold on. Our uh, chip sapphire. Oops, well. Okay, so now you can see what one looks like splattered and one not. In case you're not into splattering. But it is addictive. So there you go. That is our two envelopes, junk mail envelopes that we've turned into a four pocket journal tuck or you can put it on as a side tuck pocket or whatever but lots of different things you can do with it so i hope y'all enjoyed it thanks for um watching thanks for sharing some of your time with me and um i will see you on the next video thank you for all your love all your support thank you to everybody who supported me on my ko-fi channel and uh I know I need to get back. I'm, I'm, we're gonna, I'm, I'm feeling better now that I'm down here actually doing it, but I'm still having problems seeing. But anyway, <laughs> I know it's ha any of you people who have sinus and allergy problems, you understand the sinus pressure headache with the blurred vision stuff in the uh, eyes. So I will see y'all in the next video. Lots of kisses, lots of love. Y'all have a great day and a blessed day. And now I got blue fingers. Well, poo. All right. Well, I'll see y'all later. <laughs> Bye.